A reported kidnapping at Crabtree Valley Mall Wednesday afternoon leaves many questions to be answered, but authorities, they say they're searching for a suspect. CBS 17's Mariah Ellis is live where officers found the uh, victim. Mariah, you've been hearing from people who live in that area about all of this that happened. What are they saying? Yeah, just down the end of the street here, we have a construction site, and that's where workers had told us that a female victim had come up to them asking for help. They dialed 911. Now, police say they have not made any arrests at this point, but I can tell you neighbors are definitely relieved that this woman is safe. It's a call that came in Wednesday afternoon. Oh, the police department has responded to 105 Turner Street, 105 Turner Street. Reference kidnapping. Raleigh police officers responding to a reported kidnapping just before 3 o'clock. Calling about us that she was kidnapped. Saying that they, she took her from Crabtree Mall to this location. Doesn't know who the subject is. I was walking outside of my house and I just saw one cop car pull up with a cop with a long rifle walking down that behind that house. As we're leaving, we see like two, three other patrol cars just like coming down our street. Neighbors living near Hillsboro and Turner yeah, Street who witnessed several police cars in the area are still asking questions. That's where police found the victim telling officers she was kidnapped at Crabtree Valley Mall by a man she didn't know. Hey, roll in. Yeah. 10 for him. We plan to be in a strangle and uh, Raleigh, the vehicle that's registered to her is a white uh, Cadillac. Um, he has apparently taken this car. You know, it scared me a little bit that there's kidnapping going on down the street. Raleigh police are still looking into the circumstances surrounding this incident and continue to collect statements and review surveillance video for people like Hayes Ferens, who has a younger sister. It's a sobering reminder to be aware at all times. She carries around pepper spray now because of all the things happening. She goes out on the town and that is like one of the things like not she's concerned of, but just my mom really worries about her making sure she's safe, her phone's charged, just being aware of your surroundings. Now, the, the victim, you know, we do know that she told police that she was taken from Crabtree Valley Mall. However, we did reach out to staff there and they did not comment. And Raleigh Mariah Ellis, CBS 17 News.